Hey, what's up, guys? We're Let's Play back here, and today we're on a deck I, I've yet to play. I played a similar version of a very, very early concept of Ka Kazakuzan uh, Druid, but this is the current version um, of what is now called Dragon Druid. And yeah, I, I really wanted to try it. I still think that I prefer Lion Cracker just looking at the deck. Um, I'm, I'm a very, very big fan of Lion Cracker, but as we saw, this deck can just beat Lion Cracker if you RNG hard enough. <laughs> um, yeah, uh, overall though, I do, I do think this deck is really, really cool and looks, it looks fun. It looks fun to play, not gonna lie. So with that being said, how about we queue up the first game and, uh, let's, let's see where it takes us. All right, guys. So with that being said, I'll see y'all there. All right, first matchup against a mage. Uh, okay, this sounds pretty dope. That's like a that's, a, that's actually such a cool combo. Actually, this deck does play one of my favorite combos uh, ever in Hearthstone. Like I would probably say top three or four favorite combos in all of Hearthstone, which is the Twig of the World Tree plus uh, Sphere of Sapiens. I, I, I don't know why I love it, but I just love the fact that you just like ramp Omega hard and you're just chilling. I find that such a cool concept, and I don't know, I, I really, really like it. Although, I have not, I've not queued into this deck in a while, and I think I lose this deck. The deck that I think beats this is Linecracker Druid. Like, one of the bigger ones that beats it is definitely just Linecracker. This hand is really shit. I think I'm coining this out. So... Like next turn I coin that out, then I play Marauder on four, Guff on five, and I just punch with my weapon every single turn. It'd be really nice if I draw Sphere on five. Uh, but this way I can go Guff into Sphere. Like that would be optimal. But yeah. But yeah, no, this deck definitely does lose to Linecracker just because they won't. Oh my god, we actually hit it. That's disgusting. So the reason we're doing this, by the way, next or in two turns and not next turn, is because this has gained ten mana crystals. And if I'm not mistaken, uh, if I play it now, it's just gonna put me up to ten. If I have Guff, it will put me up to sixteen. And that's so much more mana that I think it's just worth it. Uh, here I think this is actually just the play here. Okay, we have one minion left we only have vargoth until this is active which is really nice we also just slam this super fucking early here which might just be enough to carry us uh we also have this which is really really nice okay so i can pull it this card's like dead i guess it gets mally but okay well there's mally So that card, yeah. So you see how we just gained 16 mana crystals here? I feel like that had to be the right play. Let's gain a mana crystal. You know, let's just, uh, actually we can just do this here. That's fine. Now we can slam Kazakazan next turn, which is really, really dope. I don't think there is a brand effect that you can get, but it'd be really cool just to start eating multiple things out of his hand. Oh, I see what he's doing now. To be fair, this into this is going to be a really, really sick combo. Let's just see if we can do that next turn. Because that makes sense. I mean, hopefully he has something in hand. Maybe we should wait till he's a little bit further along in quest. Uh. Is there something I'd rather have in my deck than Lunar Eclipse? Yeah. Basically, oh, that's that's not it. <laughs> let's, let's start with this. I think this is the right call here. Uh, transform all minions into random ones that cost three more. That's actually such a sick combo with this. Destroy a minion restore its health to your hero. Let's just do this. Let's do this. Uh, I don't know what's the right to take, but he 
We <laughs> all felt super fucking weak. Um. All right, let's. I guess we'll, I'm just gonna do this here. Draw a card here. All right. Well, we ate what we wanted to eat at least. I know he has a second one in his deck, but now it requires him drawing the second one before I can proc his block and move on. Um. There sadly was no damage that I was offered, I don't think, so I don't really have anything to combo with this, except for, like, I guess I have Swipe, which is kind of a combination, but, hey. Uh, let's go to a different card. That's fine. That can hit there. I think this into this might just be worth it. Or I can just do this, actually. I do really like this into the puzzle box. Let's just do this. Look, let's do this. Alright. So one of the interesting things here is that if he kills these on his turn, he could also just lose the game. Um... Theoretically, he takes enough damage, he can just die to the bombs triggering on his turn. Uh, so right now, I'm going to throw all of these at face. He won't be quite dead, but with the combination of cards in our hand, we should be able to proc his block at least, and then give him basically next turn to go off. Um, and if he has to go off by killing one of our minions, the bomb can always just kill him on his turn. And then the bro even if we don't proc the block, it still just kills him, right? I don't, I don't think that deck puts any real board wipes, but yeah, just, I think the players just hit this. So that's nine. Mm, I guess that's fine. Well, I'm going to go for this here. Beautiful. Yeah, that's fine. He, we've proc'd his block. He can no longer really kill our bombs. I should have probably played that to put him down to one. Uh, or to two. That would have been significantly better. It would have meant that anything that just deals damage to the board lo lost in the game. I should have played Malagos on the other side. That's my bad. I fucked up there. If Malagos was on this side, he couldn't play that without dealing damage to his board. I, to be fair, I didn't really think of Shooting Star. But it would have been... Okay, I'm just dead. Never mind. Fun. I was one turn too slow. Did he actually draw the second parrot? So he has to have drawn the second parrot. Or else he can't win. He actually drew both parrots. It must be nice to draw them both in the top five cards of your deck. Oh, man. You can't always beat the combo deck. Sometimes they just get luckier than you. See, this is why the the armor deck beats this, because there's nothing he could realistically do to beat the armor deck. Is the funny thing. Why do you bother wasting your time playing other cards? Like, you just win the game here. He should actually just win the game here. Through combat damage. Unless he can deal 60 damage in a... In the game but i doubt that i might as well sit through it to see i should have played injured marauder it would have killed off the five four or the four five hmm. 
Yeah, it would have killed this off. And then I would have been like only taken one and it would have been signif I would have been a significant actually no, he would have just hero powered it twice. But I would have been in a better position. Uh even though we got lucky and we ate one of his guys, it didn't matter. He did use both potion of illusions, which I mean he has two more left, basically, right? In two taken extra turns, can he kill us? I don't think so. I mean, he might be able to, but who knows at this point. Well, he fucked up. He's going to try to take an extra turn. He's going to cast the Firelands portal. All right, this is the last spell that cost five or more that you played? Yeah. He threw the game. I'm pretty sure he would have been able to kill me. You just had to not do that. Cast your Firelands portal targeting self. Please, that would be so funny. Targeting self? Hit him in the face for four? Aw, oh, sad face. <laughs> yeah, he fucked up. <laughs> See, that's I guess that's how we win. Uh, he plays Firelands Portal for some strange reason in a game he has no business losing. But okay, you know what? I'll take it. <laughs> Slowly trying to get back to top one k. Uh, anyways, though, with that being said, let's uh let's keep the next one. All right, Warlock. My guess is even. If I had to take a wild guess, I'm gonna keep this. Our hand is not nearly as disgusting as our last one was. 16 mana on turn 3 is not... Is not... Is not fair. Also, by the way, if you guys have any deck suggestions for standard, because once again, we have a standard quest that we have to play through. Um, like, we have to play 3 games in standard or whatever, or 2 games. So if you guys have any uh, recommendations of fun... more I guess decks on the slower side, uh, please uh, feel free to leave them down below. Also... Deck ideas for wild for videos on the channel. I'm honestly looking at, like, in between games, I was looking at the decks that people are currently playing in standard and, like, the meta. Kind of looks like shit, not gonna lie. Um, there is a, there's a, there is actually this, like, the standard version of this deck that I guess looks playable, but it still looks less fun than this deck. This hand does really shit. Kind of sucks. Uh, this can be even, it could be, or sorry, this can be Reno, or it can be Agony, or it can be Mechathun, or it can be one of the 30 combo decks that Warlocks have right now. Um, I don't think we beat Agony, if I'm being honest. But, depending when he goes, I guess if he's playing the Togwaggle combo... Which, I mean, gets fucked by me just eating his... Th okay, it's Reno. Okay. Yeah, the, so I had to burn that there because leaving Bran alive at any point in any game of Hearthstone is bad. <laughs> Not only in Standard, but also, or in wild, sorry, but also in battlegrounds, when Brandon survives, it just feels bad. So try to avoid it as best as possible. Guff top deck. Guff top deck one time would have been beautiful. Is it actually Reno lock? I was not expecting to face Reno lock. If I'm being honest, hopefully this can eat and is off. Hmm. Okay, well, I gotta play this at least next turn. I can actually double it to guarantee pull both. But then, it's like, the problem is if I do that, I put a 50-50 at recasting it. No, that's fine. I'll take the 50-50. Yeah, I would have lost, so it made sense. I roll 50-50? Never mind. Never lucky. Oh, feels bad. What can you do? Okay. 
At least we have a blocker up right now, which is pretty nice. He's gonna guy me again, yeah. Yeah, I mean, I can play a two drop card. Okay, I can play this at least. That's a card. Let's just slam this here. It's not necessarily the best card to eat, but I'll take it. There's definitely bigger things in his deck that I would have rather eaten. Uh, Ticketus being one of them. I don't say anything but that. Of course. Actually, just never lucky. This is fucking ridiculous. How did he, he only... Man. There's three minions in my hand. You pulled a one that I can't win without, basically. Oh, alternate win con. I need, I need to just draw cards here. If I'm being honest, the three damage I'm not that scared of. I just need to draw the cards. I need to find Guff. So J Idol is now my win con, right? But this is just the best alternate win con I could have hit, if I'm being honest. Especially, I doubt he's playing Tick nowadays. There's no way he's playing. I hate this game. I fucking hate this game. He's just perfect energy to me. I mean, there's nothing There's nothing else I could have done. <laughs> I guess Malagos double swipe is a lot of damage. That's, I actually kind of wanted that to stay in the deck. I want to discover another swipe with this. Beautiful. I can't actually play all three of them together, though. That would be 12 plus 9 is not enough. What the fuck? Okay. That was weird. I, I forgot that the music was playing because it just stopped. And then it just cut in very abruptly. I'm listening to a new, uh, a new one, like a new, uh, song thing. So I, I was definitely not expecting that. Sorry about that. <laughs> Actually, I can with Twig of the World Tree if it's on one. Which was hell is nice. I have to stop drawing cards though. Let's gain a mana crystal. How do I, I need to win somehow through a combination of Malagos and Onyxia, right? Because he just pulled everything perfectly. If you'd have pulled Malagos, by the way, with a uh, rat, he lost the game, I think. Just on the basis of Kazakazan is Kazakazan, and that card is pretty good in Druid. Um... Okay, I need a ramp like as fast as possible. I need to find so I use my hero power now, or my weapon now to dig for world tree, right? So wait, that's 18, that's 27. So it is theoretically lethal from here. I need to hit 10 mana and draw the other swipe. And not be dead by that time. If you eat my Malagos now, I'm going to be pissed. Beautiful. I can't really attack into that, but I am going to have to, actually. Oh, fuck. I missed one armor. I don't think it should make a difference, but it might. I can actually have a lot of swipes. I know you might say poison seeds is better there, but like I'm almost guaranteed to hit poison seeds now with my uh Oh I don't have sphere anymore, huh? Yeah, I should have probably taken poison seeds. No, I, I have taunt for next turn. Okay, so nine. So we can play two max, right? That's the whole thing. 
I can play two and then I tackle world tree and then I can play another two. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Oh, I should have attacked a three now. What the fuck am I doing with my life? If you have something else to eat a card out of hand, I mean, I lose the game, but what can you do? I need to just delay for as long as possible. Poison Seed's going to be really good at that. I basically need just two more turns, though. Or three more turns. I need to survive for three more turns. So this is one turn. Ideal, I'm going to have to use my hero power to draw a card next turn anyways. To hit the Poison Seeds, guaranteed. So, yeah. Poison Seeds is the only card I need to see right now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Fuck, I'm dead, right? I'm one hit off. I'm actually one hit off. Come on. I guess I just have to go for this, right? Oh, he's just gonna Reno. Oh well. I was one a turn away from winning this game, even though he had like perfect RNG. Just slam the Reno. I know you have it, just slam it. Don't waste my time. Slam or slam your 10 Kosuke Kodakus potion where you hit deal 8. Why are you roping a game where you got really lucky to win? Well, apparently I still win. Well, uh... I feel like I robbed him. <laughs> like, actually, Giga robbed him of that win. He got so lucky, and yet... Didn't matter. So that's why you play Malagos. I, I was playing Malagos sure the whole time. <laughs> I don't know why he didn't just slam... It didn't make any sense there not to just slam... Reno. Unless he wasn't holding it, and he had five cards left in his deck. But it just didn't make any sense. You slam that, you would slam Nizoth there, you would slam Gul'dan there, just to have a little bit more health and not worry about the Malagos. Because if I have another swipe, you're probably dead anyways. Right, so it didn't make sense his play there, in my opinion. Uh, anyways, we have time for one more game, so uh, let's, uh, let's queue it up real quick. Alright guys, I'll see y'all there. Okay, so this is probably the mirror match. This is like, I think the most popular one. Uh, I'm going to keep the card draw in my hand. I can keep Kazakas on, but I don't think so. I don't think it's the correct keep, basically. That's what I'm saying. Drawing this was so shit. This is a bad draw. I mean, it's just not really a, card, a draw, right? If we're being honest, hitting either four drop is not really a draw because you want to hit them off Oaken Summons. Um, Oaken Summons on three are on, on four into... into Injured or into Vargoth into Injured Marauder is an instant one. Oh, it's this deck. That's a really shit card to see. Now it's even worse that I drew this because now I can't even pull the 510 off this. So I just have like actually. That's super fucking bad. I just have a fucking six mana 5 4. I need to draw poison seeds. I need to find Spreading Plague. Mali plus Swipe. 
I mean, Molly plus swipe is way late game, but I kind of want to coin this out just so I have a little bit more ramp in hand. Um, no, I feel like this is just better. Gives me a little bit of that health gain I need for right now. Um, next turn to play is probably coin solar ferocious howl. Draw two, gain like ten. That thing needs to die yesterday. Okay, well, that's not the play now. That thing cannot be allowed to live. I feel like this is just better. Mally's not what I really want to see. I'm going to draw another card. Spreading Plague is a beautiful draw. Phenomenal card draw right there. I should have played this though, thinking about it. If I played this, I would have drawn the four things, and then this way next and this was huge. Yeah, this is... This is okay here, but it's not ideal. I would really like to see Spreading Plague, or Poison Seeds. This is also pretty nice. Fuck, I was hoping for a Sphere. I'll take another uh, leg. I would have loved to see... There's so many cards I would have rather see over those ones in my deck, if I'm being honest. Seed, Swipe, Sphere. This is I could play this next turn, and then go this, Swipe, or some combination like that. I'm in a really, really good position. This deck has so much inevitability. Like, just looking at it, man. Well, this deck was filthy. I think this deck might be top tier. Just maybe. Okay. I still need to find poison seeds. I need to find wipe. I need to find half the cards in my fucking deck. Uh yeah, Druid, Druid decks like this one are really bad against this style of deck, if we're being honest. It's just something you have to learn to accept if you want to play this style of deck. This is Discovering a Spell. This card is nuts, by the way. I love this card. I wish it was a little bit more playable, but it's sadly not. Uh, hmm. This is why we want to see swipe. Depending on what that is, it's terrifying. That's terrifying. Okay, I need to find poison seeds like right now. Nope, that's not give me a spell. Well, I like how they sped up this animation. Sorry, I'm not saying much. I'm just in such a shit position that I just can't figure out what I need to do off the top of my head and it's making my plays really really hard to figure out because I need to draw a lot of cards in the position I am in in order to get anywhere but at the same time I can't draw a lot of cards because I need to still set up a board where I don't just die if that's Arbor I lose the game it's Arbor 100% <laughs> yeah he picked it way too fast for it not to be Arbor I can still possibly win through Poison Seeds. I can't. He still has a second Arbor in hand. Hmm. Swipe, swipe. We don't have enough mana for that. Hmm. Yeah, no, this is, this is not, 
This is not looking ideal. I think I just need to gain all of the armor here. I should have. I should have played Oaken. What are the best hits for me? So it's gonna be hit, hit. Ten. Plus twelve. It's 29. Even though I gain six more armor, I can't survive, right? Nah. No, I should. It should have been Oaken summons. Oh well, I'm done on board. There's no point of letting him rope me in order to kill me. If I'm being honest, I'll just I'll just hit the concede button and uh, have it end a little bit faster. Oh man, that's tilting. I thought we were gonna get the perfect video, but then we did not. Also, as you can see, I bought the I finally bought the packs for the new set. Actually, let's open these ones because I do have other packs to open. It came with mercenary packs, and I got this one from doing tavern brawl. Oh, golden. I'm always happy with goldens. I have all these cards, though. But yeah, I'm always happy with goldens. You know me. I like my shiny cards. Oh, we got a new hero. We got a lot of epics. Rare. Oh, sure, they added a whole bunch of new mercenary cards, huh? Oh, legendary Lich King. Oh, rare. Feels bad. Uh, Mercenaries is actually one of those... Fucked game modes that still doesn't have... Ooh, Nefarian. Well, now I don't have to buy that bundle. <laughs> I wasn't going to do it anyways. I don't, if I'm being honest, I don't play enough of this game mode to make it worth it. Oh, epic. Gruel. There's a dinosaur. I like dinosaurs. <laughs> no, but uh, if I'm being honest, I just... What the fuck is this? I've never seen this. Oh, is this an alternate hero portrait? What the fuck? I've genuinely never seen what the fuck that is. That's partially because I've played like five games of mercenaries. I've played a little bit of mercenaries, but it's still... Oh, that's not what I want to do. What the fuck did I just get? Where is Mr. Smite? Oh, it's just an alternate hero portrait. Okay. Just how, like, she has alternate hero portraits. Okay, interesting. Interesting. That's that's enough of mercenaries for tonight. What the fuck? I hate that it always says that there's new shit. I, I hate that I can't get... Like, even in here, right? They fixed it for some of them, but now there's new ones that I just can't see. Like, okay. Where, where, where's the unchecked ones? No, where's the ones I can click on? Just clicking on things is fun. I mean, I can't even click on this one, bruv. What about this? Where, where? Oh, there actually is one here. Okay. There, I, I was actually have to click on one. I'm happy. But yeah, I feel like this game just gets more and more broken every single time we play it. And it's kind of funny. Every single time I play it, there's new things I can't click on that it says that I should be able to. Oh, well. Anyways, also that, that percentage seems wrong. 3% and I mean, I've done a lot of them. I don't know. Maybe it is 3%. I, I don't math. But anyways, yeah. With all that being said, 100% complete. I mean, where? Uh. Anyways, though. With all that being said... I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys did, don't forget to like and subscribe. As always, follow me on Twitch and Twitter. Um, don't forget about those decks down below. Both deck recommendations for Wild and deck recommendations for Standard. I did get a uh, recommended one recently for Wild that I've been thinking about doing. So I think I might do it. Um, and uh, yeah. Anyways, though, with all that being said, I'll see you guys all in the next one. Alright, guys? Yeah, I'll see you all there. Have a great day, and I'll see you guys there. Peace.